right guys, Andy Outdoors here, how are we all doing? Well, me late to the camps today. Dogs are having free kids, I suppose. Yeah, on our way to camp, cooking some bacon butties and building some raised beds there, that's the plan. It's on my way down there now. Broke my bag on the way up here. I'm gonna get down this path. I'll bring you back when we're in camp. Well, as you can tell, we made it to the camp. Got to the camp ready, and there's a nice fire on the go. And bacon butties will be coming on soon. Just getting a brew on the go. They've won those new pots, have a look at it. It's still a bit hot, is it? It's still a bit hot, yeah. I mean, Dav's got the zebra can. Yeah. Really good bit of kit. This year, I think it's supposed to be somewhere along the same lines, but for about just over a tenner off eBay. Got a spout on it. I know David is partial to a brew every two or three minutes. Yeah, yeah, definitely. So it's got a couple of handles on the side. It does come in its own little carry case. And uh, best, yeah. my cup actually fits inside it as well, so Brucey bonus. I suppose with the cup fitting inside it, like I don't know if anybody does it though. What's a poached egg, is it? Do you poach an egg in a cup in a bottle of yeah. water? Yeah. yeah, yeah. You could use it as a separate cupping container. Yeah. So it was nice to get to camp. Fire on the go ready. The only thing I've got to do is fill the gaps in on the, on the heat reflector wall thing. You'd be jigs, jigs, jig, jigs. So the because there's a bit of wind coming up the hill, which you don't usually get, and going and smoking in my shelter a little bit. So apart from that, looking well. Um, nice to get to camp. Yeah. I think I owe your viewers a bit of an apology because a bit low on. Uh, I said I was going to bring the fire electric. You remember what I was saying? I had to make electric in the from a fire. Yeah, yeah. Christmas out of the way, totally put it on the back burner. So, well, yeah, Christmas is busy for everybody. Right? Kids and Christmas, family takes all your time up, doesn't it? I'm going to make a, a promise to you all now and to Dav. The next video will contain the thing that makes the electric to charge your phone. I promise you. Well, there we go. I'm getting smoked out a bit, but we promise now. Part two. I'm looking forward to it myself. I told you, I'm, me and electrics don't get on. <laughs> so, give me a piece of word and I'll carve you an owl. <laughs> Electrics, no. Well, I'm rambling too much now. Bacon butties, I think. Oh, me and Wonder just chilling out for a minute now. Just while this uh, fire dies down, get some coals on the go. Just get these bacon. And. I know I gave you a shout out last week, but one day's wild camp and bushcraft. Nice bit of fat wood. Yeah, we're just having a bit of a mess around now with the tinder kits and getting a few little fires going, just having a little laugh and that. Let's see what's best to light a fire. We've got a load of things in our fire kits now. I mean, we've gone as far as uh, we've even got a bit of gunpowder here. There's tons of stuff you can use, everybody knows. Oh, yeah, we've Back got from the natural materials to the. to whatever you yeah. think you can light a fire with. Yeah. I mean, we've got a flint and striker, never let you down, they always work, stay forward, everybody knows how these work. Um, Davy's got the birch bark, brilliant stuff. Yeah, it's more of yours there. Um, did you tell them about these things you made, Dav? Yeah, I told you about the, about them little wax balls. I brewed a fire, uh, brewed a fire. I brewed some hot water off one of them little balls, and they burned for at least a good six, seven minutes, and it, Zebra can, boiling water, can go better. You can, if you can boil water in a zebra can off one of them, they're fantastic. You've no need to light a fire. If you're somewhere where you don't really don't really want to light a big bloody forest fire or anything like that, one of them, fantastic. I've gone as far as made my own fire. Fat wood. So, boiled these in wax. They work really well. Obviously, they're not natural fat wood, but they do exactly the same as what the, the good stuff is. Um, another thing I did, some... Misses might go a bit mad, but we got some of the cotton pads, just like Dav, how we made the fat, the balls. But once I'd finished with this, there was a little bit of wax left over. Dip them in, let them dry, and they are fantastic. Exactly like David's balls. <laughs> <laughs> they, they like to I think he likes fire. my balls. <laughs> we got some uh, some leftover wax here. Wood shavings. 
Um, again, a little bit of sawdust and the gunpowder. So I think we're going to try, we'll try a few of these, see which one lights quickest, what we get out of it, what embers we can get. Oh, didn't mention these as well. Got these from work. Basically what they are, they're like uh, wooden earbuds. Well, I soak them in, because i got a fire in the house, I soak them in paraffin, and one of these will light a fire instantly. So I thought, why not chop them up, put them in a bag, push comes to shove, we can use one of these to light it. And we've also got a lighter. So if all else fails, I know it's a bit of cheating, but we'll use that. I'll hand you back over to Dad. I said we're going to mess around now, I'm going to try and get some little fires going off this. Mess around, coals go down, they're coming on nicely now. And bacon butties. And of course I'm going to bring you back with the bacon butties, aren't I? I think I forgot the sauce as well. Right, one is going to do a few tryouts for you, see what he's got in his tin in the kit. Make a few little fires. Yeah, bingo. It starts off with the fat wood. A bit of a virgin knife here. A lot of resin in this dab as soon as I start. resin on it. Rinse and strike it. Straight away. You can see the black smoke coming off it. Now you could light a candle off that. sticks that I've got. I'm not going to use too much. The black powder. So we tried this, me and Dad, before we did the video. We both still got our eyebr eyebrows, but we'll see how this goes. Yay! As you can see, that would be easy to light up. What else have we got, Dad? The birch bark, wasn't it? Yeah. I think what Dad did as well. This went up really well. First time we tried it. I think that should be enough. Well, Dav has informed me using my knife like this will blunt it, but for the price of it. I think it's just a math the fact of rolling the blade over a little bit of the wood's a bit hard. But for six to seven quid, ideal knife. We all know the moral is fine. Grab that in the corner there. Let's see if we can get that going as well. Instantly. And that's just birch bark. So all these man-made products, something that nature provides, light's the easiest. A little demonstration for you. Yeah, great stuff. Back to basics. Buddy. That's the second lot of bacon on the rib. Uh, that's my first bap. I was enjoying it that much, I thought I'd put the better record to him. Yeah. I'm going to bap all these up in a minute. Might have a bit of a toasted bap now as well. Just have a swing a bit extra. I'll bring you back and I'm going to try and get a raised bed done today. Try. I'm going to have a slouch day today. 
Right guys, well, instead of me getting smoked out, I'm going to go on, there's a fallen hazel tree on there, a lot of big strip pieces. I'm going to go and see if I can pinch a few pieces off that and try and get these raised beds built. We're going to try a, a bungee bed today. Get all the framing up for that and then wrap it all around this bungee rope we got. Yeah, should be good. See if it's getting smoked out. I'm just going to go for a little trek of that. And I'll come bring you back when i got all the pieces, hopefully. Good, Paul. Nothing better. Come on. We've just been joined by Wonder's little lad. It's Tom there. Wonder's just showing him how to Use some fat wood. He's gonna have his first goal of using some fat wood, you know. So rather than Tom staying in and playing on the Xbox, there's nothing wrong with that by the way in the winter, because I do that. There is something wrong with it, we need to be out. Yeah, we need to be out. outside. So he's shown a keen interest in coming out, so I thought why not promote it? So we're gonna scrape some of this fat wood off now. And this is Tom's first official attempt to light this fat fat wood shavings. Yeah. So Tom, if you want to put the point of that into that, like we showed you, and see if you can get it going. That's it, keep going. Almost there, mate. A bit more. Yeah, yeah. Let's yeah. Hold your fire seal tight to the wood, yeah? You keep the fire seal there and you push that Straight down. Straight down. Nearly, nearly. Don't worry, your dad didn't do it first time either, but I think you nearly got it. There you go, yeah. fantastic. Great stuff. Brilliant, Tom. Look at me. Okay. Yeah, I've got a smile. There's a smile there. Happy days. How easy was that? It's pretty easy. And I know it's easy to use a lighter, but now you know you can. You don't have to light it. You just an ordinary lighter. There we go. So we else, get up the house. Start doing it. Yeah, well, we've collected all the wood for the raised bed. That was a bit of an effort just to get some straight pieces. Round here is not the best for straight pieces, but we've managed to get them now. Wonders has got a brew on him for us all. Yeah, Tom's still here, having a brew as well. We missed out on the bacon butties though. We'd have come out of bed a bit early, could have had some bacon butties of us. Yeah, the next time maybe you know, get this brew and we'll show you the raised bed when we build it. Alright, guys, well, we drank our brews. There he is, Mr. Frodo. Been a long time, innit? There we are, you see the raised beds around? Right? He's got this little piece, we'll do all that now. Let's come up now. Might make him a brew in a minute, see if he's good. Yeah, it's nice to go out though. So, yeah, we're going to finish this bed and I'll be wrapped up for today then. And then next week, hopefully this bed will be getting done. I said them taps didn't come before, I'm going to have to order some new ones. Anybody knows any good places or good taps, pop a link in so I can follow it please. Yeah, get some tarps up here then. Nice house in end of February, I think it's going to be happening. Yeah, be good. Mr. Frodo said he's going to be coming. Yep. Yeah, be good. Whittling an old stick there. Fire's all died out now. Should be camber angle. Yeah, I saw some heat coming from it. Let's let that die out, we'll put some water on that then. Always keep spare water here just in case. Yeah, we good then. Alright, guys, well, we'll just work to wrap it up for the day. So far, we got. We'll finish all that next time. It's looking good though. I'm 17 stone and it holds my weight, so doing something right, aren't we? Oh, you're it. Yeah, it's looking well. I like the fact it's easy. You have leaves and all that, don't you? 
I'm happy with that, like. Fire's yeah. been put out, everything's safe. We've Good. left our zero footprint, left in as we've seen it. All the rubbish taken home, including this rubbish here. That's one. <laughs> yeah, See got the bag time. wrapped up there, got the rubbish. Yeah. Don't forget to subscribe, like. See you next time. <laughs>